Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. Today's topic is derivation of d square by 162. So now, how d square is also known as phi square. d square is represented by phi square. Now how phi square by 162 became a constant to find weight of steel per meter. So before getting into it, let's know about the length of steel bar available in market. Actually, the whole rod was bent and the, the whole length is 12 meter plus or minus 5 mm, approximately 40 feet. So here 5 mm is the tolerance value actually, tolerance. So tolerance is given because it was a mission made which is happened in uh, industries. So uh, for that there is no accuracy rate. That's the reason why 5 mm is the tolerance value. Now how phi square by 162 became a constant to find out the weight, right? So let's get into the solution. We know density is equals to weight by volume, right? So now we need a weight. So now we want to find out weight, right? Weight per meter. So now weight is equals to per meter, right? Uh, now weight is equals to density into volume. So here the density of the steel is 7850 kg per meter cube and volume is given as cross sectional area into length of the steel rod. So now length is 1 meter, we already know that. 7850 in, into pi d square by 4 into 1. Pi d square by 4 is the cross sectional area of steel bar. So 1 meter is given taken as a length because we are calculating per meter. Now 7850 by 10 cube whole cube mm cube. Here, so 10 cube whole cube mm cube will be become because we are converting uh, meters into mm. So 1 meter equals to 1000 mm, 1 meter cube is equals to 10 cube whole cube mm cube. So 1 meter cube is equals to 10 power 3 whole power 3 mm cube. So that's the reason why we are giving here. And now pi d square by 4 is the cross sectional area so we know that steel bar is in circular shape and the uh, area of a uh, circle is pi d square by 4 that's the reason why pi d square by 4 is mentioned here and meter is converted into mm so that one meter is equals to 1000 mm now we can make sure that it will be given as 7.85 into 10 power minus 6 into pi d square by 4 into 1000 so now 7.85 into 10 power minus 3 by 4 into pi d square. So now 10 power minus 6 into 10 power minus 3. Wait. 10 power minus 6 into 10 power 3. That is equals to 10 power minus 3. So now keep 10 power minus 3 as it is and calculate rest of the value. We will get 6.1653 into 10 power minus 3. It was explained here. Please go through it. Now 6.1653 into 10 power minus 3 will become 1 by 162.19 into d square. So now here d square is phi square. So now phi is the dia of steel bar. So approximately phi square by 162 is the value to calculate weight of steel per meter. This is the empirical formula derivation. So please do subscribe to my channel and I encourage us to do more videos. Thank you all and don't forget to click on the bell icon.